Greetings, everyone. Well, today I have kind of a strange and unexpected update for you. Let me tell you the story. So the other day I was chatting with one of my coworkers, and the conversation turned to digital streaming versus physical media. Uh, he was telling me how he got to thinking recently how he hasn't really watched any of his physical media for a year or more and uh, hasn't bought a DVD or a Blu-ray. He's only bought one Blu-ray in his entire life. If you're wondering which one it was, it was Mirror Mask. And just never watches his DVDs anymore. He says he just watches everything on streaming services. And uh, he asked if I still watch my DVDs. And I said, oh yeah, you know, I watch DVD, Blu-ray, whatever. I'm just, uh, and streaming. I mean, I'm, I'm just basically a media junkie. Hence the Multimedia Chronicles. come all about all multiple forms of media. And uh, he was like, oh, okay, you know, interesting. You know, I, I don't know many people who, who still watch uh, disc. Everybody I know just seems to watch streaming all the time. And I said, yeah, you know, I, I watch a, mi a mix. Like, uh, I'll watch a TV show via streaming or on demand to, you know, watch it every week and stuff like that. And if I like it, I'll go out and buy the Blu-ray later. And, uh, and that was pretty much it for the conversation. So a couple days go by, and we're chatting again. And... Uh, you know, I'm just about to head back to work. He said, oh, by the way, um, I have something I think uh, you might be interested in. I'll, uh, I'll message you later. I'm like, okay, cool. I'm, I'm thinking, you know, maybe a, a DVD or, or a comic book maybe because, you know, he, he's a comic book fan too and we talk about comics quite a bit. So I go back to work and then I get a message from him a couple hours later and he says, uh, yeah, how would you like to have my entire DVD collection, no charge, delivered? There's about a hundred DVDs, and I'm like, I'm like, yes. <laughs> like, what am I gonna say? Yes, I would like to have your entire collection at no charge delivered. Thank you. And that that was pretty much it. And then today, he drove me home with, well, let me show you. Hold on a sec. His entire collection. That's a lot of DVDs. So this is going to take a little bit of time to get through, so let's get right to it. My co-worker's DVD collection, today on the Multimedia Chronicles. I haven't gone through these yet. I actually saved it for you guys, so I know a couple of things that's in here, but uh, but nowhere near all of it. So it's going to be a surprise to all of us. All right, so let's get right to it, shall we? Um, hmm. Maybe we should do a different angle. Maybe we'll do this on the floor. Okay. Hi, everybody. Hi. Alright. Well, I guess we'll just pick a bag and start here. Alright. Well, we got X Files Season 1. I'm just going to grab a handful here. Got uh, Jet Lee's Fearless. Oh. <laughs> These are kind of dirty cases. Hold on a second. This one's falling out. There we go. We got a, uh, it's like a four kung fu uh, feature here. We got Militant Eagle, the Prodigal Boxer, uh, the Bloody Fists, and Moonlight Sword and Jade Lion. Awesome. So we're going to start a little kung fu pile here. We got, holy crap, dusty much. We got Brotherhood of the Wolf. I have to clean these cases. Oh, Contact. I actually have this on Blu ray. Excellent movie. And, oh god, the Marky Mark, uh, Planet of the Apes. Excellent. I do not have that. Now I don't have to spend money on it. Excellent. Uh, oh, here we go. We got Matrix Reloaded. Matrix Revolutions. The Sixth Sense. Excellent. Oh, sweet. This one's pretty cool. 
Apocalypse Now, the complete dossier. This is, uh, I'll probably hang on to this one, actually. This is a nice addition. I do have sort of the, the I have the Blu-ray equivalent of this, but this is just a really snazzy addition. Nice, uh, nice little collector's item there. Very cool. So, uh, I don't know, we'll set this here, I guess. What else do we got here? Uh, Serenity! Very cool, very, very good movie. Gotta love some Firefly action. Hey, we got Superman the movie! Superman 2! The Grifters! Superman 3! Superman 4! Superman Returns! Uh, oh, hey, yeah, Daredevil the Director's Cut, the original uh, DVD release, awesome. Hulk, <laughs> most of these I have on Blu-ray, but that's okay. What else we got here? Oh, nice. Actually, I, I'll definitely be hanging on to this one, because I don't uh, have not uh, had it in my collection for a while. we got David Lynch's Inland Empire, which you may recall I did a review of many moons ago. Oh, Sweet! Wonder Woman season one, awesome. We should have like a comic book uh, collection here. Let's do comic book characters, and then uh, do sci-fi. Yeah, that's good. All right, got uh, Donnie Darko, The Village. Ooh, Following. I have not seen this one from uh, Christopher Nolan. Very cool. The original Matrix, of course. And the Animatrix. Always loved the Animatrix. And let's see. Children of Dune, which I have. It's excellent. Great stuff. James McAvoy, by the way. Young James McAvoy in that. Uh, oh. I don't know what this is. This is like uh, some uh, um, Asian horror. We have Three Extremes 2. Excellent. Let's uh, start a horror section here. And then Three Extremes, of course. I don't know that one. Oh, sweet. I've been wanting to see this one for ages. I never got around to checking it out. We have What the Bleep Do We Know? Apparently a nice companion to the uh, Matrix. Bubba Hotep, which, of course, I have. I'll put that in with the... All right. One bag down. Four to go. Oh, let's get one of the big ones here. Okay. Let's see what we got. Just going to grab a handful here. We have... Seven Steps of Kung Fu. Office Space, the special edition with flair. Excellent. Uh, I don't know, comedy? Sure. Curse of the Golden Flower. Uh, Once Upon a Time in China. These are really grungy. <laughs> Excalibur. Put that there. Hey, Saw 2, the original DVD. Excellent. Okay, and then we have Saw 3, Uncut Edition. I have all the Saw movies on Blu-ray now. Uh, hey, Fight Club. Awesome, gotta love some Fight Club. Got to, oh, Talk Radio, sweet. I've been wanting to see this for so long. Awesome, definitely gonna enjoy that. Got A History of Violence. American History X. Oh, a lot of stuff that I've been wanting to see for ages in here. Uh, Angela Bassett, Marlon Brando, Robert De Niro, and Edward Norton in The Score. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Oh, hey. Hellbound, Hellraiser 2. Candyman. The Grudge. Not going to be saying too much about these. Oh, God, he didn't. He got one of the, like, the public domain El Cheapo editions of Night of the Living Dead. <laughs> Why couldn't it have been the Millennium Edition? Near Dark, this makes three times over. I have this on DVD now. Saw 4, the uh, uncut edition, of course. Is this the one, this is the one with the, uh, is the blade spin? No, this, that's, I'm thinking of a different edition. Uh, oh, Mortal Kombat and Mortal Kombat uh, Annihilation. I have this on Blu-ray. Uh, what else we got? Get Shorty. Great movie. Loved this one. I'll put that in the comedies there. And we got uh, Romeo Must Die and Cradle to the Grave. I know it's not strictly Kung Fu, but we'll put it in there because they star Jet Li. All right. And, oh, here we go. A little religion. Passion of the Christ. 
Barton Fink. Cohen Brothers, eh? Put that there. Sling Blade. I just bought this on DVD. <laughs> or on uh, Blu-ray. Altered States. This is a freaking great movie. Really, really good sci-fi movie. Some crazy, crazy effects in it. Titus. Uh, put that there. Oh my god. Gladiator Extended Edition. Look at this. Look at the size of this thing. It's just massive... Digibook of Doom. Awesome. I do have the Blu-ray of this, but this is a really cool edition. I'll probably hang on to that. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Batman Begins. Fantastic Four. I have the extended version of that. Fantastic Four, Rise of the Silver Surfer. Sin City. Constantine. Princess Mononoke. Oh, I should start an anime section. Uh, we'll put anime over here, I guess. I don't know. No, we'll put we'll put anime here. There we go. I don't know how much anime there will be. The original King Kong. Very cool. Uh, so high. There we go. Ah. Holy moly, this is going to take forever. <laughs> the Incredible Hulk. Oh, yes. If you're only going to have X-Men on DVD, this is the edition to get... X-Men 1.5, fantastic. X2, X-Men United. Sky Captain and the World of Tomorrow. Batman and Batman Returns, very nice. Looks like this was from the box set, actually. But no box. <laughs> oh, carrying on here, still only on bag two. Oh, sweet. Phantasm. Never seen the Phantasm movies. I'm going to watch the shit out of that. The Exorcism of Emily Rose. Some really good horror in here. Red Eye. Hostel. Ringu 2. I actually have the box set of all four Ringu movies. The original Hellraiser. Very cool. Oh, God. <laughs> and we have uh, Hellraiser Hellseeker. Land of the Dead. Oh, The Ring 2. I don't think I ever saw the second one. I really liked the first one. I've seen all the original uh, Asian ones. I have not, and I've seen the remake, the first uh, American one. Really liked that one. I've never seen the second one. Gattaca, excellent sci-fi movie. The Good Shepherd, never seen it. Once Upon a Time in Mexico, love it. Uh, I don't know where I'm going to put this. I'll put it there. And Robert Duvall in The Apostle. Never never seen that one. All right. Oh, it's two bags down. Three to go. Ugh, here we go. Carrying on, we have... Hey, Shanghai Noon. We'll throw that into the Kung Fu. Oh, sweet. Oh, wow, this one isn't even opened. <laughs> Cult Horror Collection. Sweet. Gonna love that. Uh, Lost, Season 3. We'll put this with TV show sets there. Uh, the Day After Tomorrow. Uh, so if I, oh, I know some people who will be jealous of this one. We have Metropolis, the anime. This is really, really good. Very, very well done. And then here we've got, let's see, Lost, Season 2. Lost, Season 5. I'm guessing the other two seasons are in here somewhere. Uh, Jet Li and Black Mask. Holy moly. This is, it just keeps going. <laughs> Happy Feet. Rosie has this. Uh, I don't know where I'm going to put this. I'll put it with anime. Yeah. Oh, God. Okay. Night Nightmare on Elm Street 4. The Dream Master. Nightmare on Elm Street 3. The Dream Warriors. Nightmare on Elm Street 2, Freddy's Revenge, and the original Nightmare on Elm Street, and the original Saw. I'm going to move the horror over because it is throwing everything else into shadow. <laughs> everything is becoming encased in darkness. Holy crap. All right. I've got uh, Saturday Night Insanity tonight, too, so I'll be going through all of these again. Awesome. <laughs> and we got Spider-Man. Spider-Man 2. Oh, sweet. This is pretty awesome. Six Feet Under, the complete first season. I've only seen bits of this. 
I remember Annetta was collecting them for a while, and then she stopped collecting them because she said it was too depressing. It was making her sad. Eh, let's see. We got X Files season two, or sorry, three, season three. There it is, X Files season two. These are, uh, yeah, these aren't the original original releases. They're one of the re-releases, but uh, still in, you know, fairly sizable packaging. Vanilla Sky, this is actually a really good one too. Uh, Nightmare on Elm Street 5, The Dream Child. Lady in the Water, which I owned briefly and never watched. Now I can watch it. Oh, sweet. Battlestar Galactica, the original 1978 uh, movie version of the pilot. Very cool. Uh, I guess we'll put that with TV shows. Uh, American Beauty. Another one I've never seen, but mean to check out for ages. Night Watch, I do have this one. Oh, Day Watch, with a cool frickin' lenticular cover. Look at that. That is awesome. Uh, actually, no. What, what am I throwing over there? That's going to horror. Okay, Friday vs. Jason. Nice, shiny cover. I just picked this one up on Blu-ray recently. And Freddy's Dead, The Final Nightmare, and New Nightmare. Look at you. Can you tell he's a horror fan? <laughs> oh, nice. Well, this saves me some money. I was actually going to repurchase this series. We have Millennium, Season 1, Season 2, and Season 3. The original Thick Case Slim Pack releases. This is fantastic. This Actually, I like this better than the... Uh, the uh, complete series set because this gives you way more package art and looks freaking awesome. Sweet! That one I'm really excited about. Alright, and let's see, got another big bag here. Let's see what we got. There's some pretty good stuff in here, I gotta say. Ah, let's see, we got Jet Li Hero. Haha. <laughs> Final Fantasy, The Spirits Within. I'm going to put this in anime just to piss people off. Uh, Final Fantasy VII, Advent Children. Master of... Oh, sweet. Master of the Flying Guillotine. Well, that just sounds like all kinds of awesome. 28 Days Later. Heathers. I love Heathers. What a wonderful movie. So much fun. I don't know what... Pile... I'll put it over here. Fine. Uh, Jet Li, The Legend 2. Lots of Kung Fu stuff here. It's great. I don't have nearly enough Kung Fu stuff in my collection. Oh, League of Extraordinary Gentlemen with a cool lenticular cover. Check that out. Very nice. That will go with comic books. And Wu-Tang Clan Iron Flag Collection Dance of Death. Awesome. Getting some cool, uh, Apparently, apparently an early... Uh, or directed by Jackie Chan. Cool. Crank, which of course I have on uh, on DVD. Uh, or Blu-ray, rather. I don't know, I'll put it, put it there in the award-winning classics collection. Righteous Kill. Oh, yeah. I've see, I used to have this one. Man with the Screaming Brain. That's good stuff. And we have Iron Monkey. Oh, the 2009 Star Trek. Uh, no, sci-fi. There we go. And let's see what else we got here. Grab another stack here. We have Hannibal Rising Unrated. I have not seen any of the sequels or prequels or anything uh, to Silence of the Lambs. I've only ever seen Silence of the Lambs. Um, yeah, I'll put it in horror. Why not? There you go. He eats people. Oh, sweet. Classic Alfred Hitchcock. Basically a nice little public domain collection there. I'll put that there, I guess. Uh, let's see, Forrest Whitaker, Ghost Dog, Way of the Samurai. Well, we'll throw this into Kung Fu. Nice, Godzilla 2000, gotta love it. I, Robot, never seen it. Oh, sweet, Shinobi, Heart Under Blade. Very nice. Oh, sweet. <laughs> uh, we got Gamera, The Ultimate Collection. Includes War of the Monsters, Destroy All Planets, and Gamera the Invincible. Excellent. Sweet. Run, Lola, Run. How is this not opened? How can you have Run, Lola, Run and never have watched it? My God, that's a travesty. This movie is fantastic. 
And then we have, oh, Guillermo del Toro, The Orphanage. I've never even heard of this one. How how did this one uh, miss me by? Miss me by? Pass me by? I will be watching the shit out of that. Oh, this one's great. I love this one. Falling Down with Michael Douglas. That's <laughs> great stuff. I'll just throw it there. The Heroic Trio. Pan's Labyrinth. Excellent. Uh, somehow, sci-fi got mixed in with comic books. There we go. Okay, we're good now. Oh, wait, there's more. It doesn't end. Holy crap. Oh, this is a really good one. A, a Scanner Darkly. Very uh, underappreciated, I think. Uh, oh, a film by Adam McGoyan. The Adjuster. I don't know this one. Very cool. Fifth Element. This is now the third copy of the Fifth Element I have in my collection. Red Dragon. Well, it's kind of cool. I can finally check out these uh, these Hannibal, uh, like Signs of the Lambs, spin-offs. Very cool. Let's see what do we got here? We have the Soul Assassins collection. We've got Secret of the Water Technique. Very cool. And then, hey, 20 movie classics, more Alfred Hitchcock, excellent. Got Blade Runner, the director's cut, of course, which is not the true director's cut. Uh, got the man, Alfred Hitchcock, the man who knew too much. Platoon, Platoon is always excellent. Clash of the Titans, love it. I have the uh, Blu-ray, of course. And then, oh, last batch here. I knew there was going to be a lot of kung fu and horror in here, because I know he's into that stuff. Nine movies on three DVDs over 13 hours. We have Martial Arts Masters. Oh, yeah. And then, from Black Beat Theater, we have The Cavalier. Ca Cavalier, sorry. Oh, shit. <laughs> A special edition of Reefer Madness. I actually have this on like a Mill Creek collection. But, uh, sweet. All includes all new color version and restored original black and white version. Awesome. That's going to be a lot of fun. And Godzilla vs. Mothra. Oh, I have not seen this one. The Host. Awesome. Oh, classic. Love it. The Day the Earth Stood Still. I did a review of that a while ago. Reservoir Dogs. Which, of course, I have on, on Blu-ray. Uh, Frost, Nixon, the... Oh, wow. The original Watergate interviews. Very cool. Oh, it's... I'm getting less and less space here. Like, here, see? I'm getting buried. I'll put this here, I guess. All right. I think we only got one bag left. It's just a little one. Ugh. Let's see what we got here. Oh, here we go. I think this rounds out some of the uh, other collections here. We got The X Files Season 4 and Season 9 and The Lone Gunman. And oh, hey, Battlestar Galactica The Plan from the 2004 series. I haven't seen any of that. Got both X Files movies. I've seen this one many times. Have not seen this one because I haven't seen to the end of the X Files series yet. And carrying on here, so last batch here. We have Hannibal, rounding out the uh, the Han well the Hannibal collection. Got Heat. I used to have this on Laserdisc. This is a great action movie. Uh, directed by Michael Mann. And rounding out the X-Files collection, we have X-Files Season 5, Season 6, Season 7, where are you? Se season 7, <laughs> and Season 8. Holy guacamole, Batman. Ugh. I don't think I can get the camera out of there now. It's barricaded by DVDs. So just, holy crap, look at all of that stuff. Like, I, I just can't believe how much he gave me. <laughs> holy moly. 
Yeah. Some of you build forts out of blankets and cushions. I build them out of mountains of DVDs. Alrighty, well, pretty cool. Thank you very much, Mr. Coworker, sir. Definitely appreciate this. A lot of stuff here that uh, I've never seen or that I've wanted to see for ages. Uh, quite a, a lot of duplicates as well. Not surprising considering we have pretty common interests, as I'm sure you can tell. Um, so for the duplicates, I'll probably do like giveaways and stuff for those. And then, um, uh, and then just, you know, keep the stuff I want to keep. Alrighty, well, I gotta get ready for Saturday Night Insanity. You're probably seeing this a few days later. Eh. Hi, how's it going? Um, so I will see you guys next time in whatever the next video is. So until then, thanks for watching. Big thanks to my Patreon sponsors, especially Get Your Gorgeous On and Kyle Pellegrin, my two highest level sponsors. You guys and gals are awesome. And uh, we'll see you next time. Until then, thanks for watching and sayonara. This is really uncomfortable. What is the final tally anyway, including the season sets as one? Let's see here. We have uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty-two, one, thirty-two, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven. <laughs> <laughs> Those are freaking heavy because they're season sets. So is that 37? 37? In a row? So 59. 59, dude! Oh, wait a minute. No. 87. It's going to be more than 100 here. Ugh. 100! 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 31 131 uh, and counting the horror stack holy shit okay 162 DVDs that's counting season sets as one and box sets of several movies as one wow 162 that's a lot of DVDs. All right. Good. Okay. Excellent.